Harry Truman's life was defined by his passion for learning, his commitment to service, and his commitment to do what is right. This is Truman. This is his presidential library, more than a world-class museum, more than a presidential research center and archive. The Truman Library is a classroom for democracy. Our team of nationally recognized educators partners with schools, teachers, and families. And because we are part of the National Archives, students and teachers benefit from the rich treasure trove of original documents, artifacts, audiovisual resources, oral histories, primary sources documenting a profound history. We draw on President Truman's life and leadership to inspire and engage students of all ages. Increasingly, this work feels like it's mission critical for our nation. Studies show that only about 30% of high school seniors have a working grasp of civics. Only one in four adults can name the three branches of our government. Our mission is clear, and the charge is from President Truman himself. We are working to safeguard America's democracy. From civics literacy programs to digital outreach, to hands-on history labs and teacher training, we impact as many as 40,000 students and teachers each year. Many are able to participate only because of our Bus Stops Here grants. Welcome to the White House Decision Center at the Truman Library. It's 1948 and President Truman is having to deal with the crisis in Berlin. The purpose of this activity is to learn how a president makes decisions. The White House Decision Center is the flagship educational program among America's presidential libraries. It's a live action simulation. Middle school and high school students step into this amazing set, a recreated West Wing, and then step up to assume the roles of cabinet members, presidential advisors, the White House press corps, and even President Truman himself. We're in the White House Decision Center. It's 1948 and our students have just broken into their meeting rooms where they're portraying President Truman, his highest advisors, and they're going through the original documents, intelligence briefings, telegrams that would have been received in that year and trying to figure out their own plan of action for how to fight the Berlin blockade of 1948. This is experiential learning at its best and it's history in today's headlines nuclear weapons, civil rights, Soviet expansion, Israel and Palestine. These kids are analyzing original documents and historical briefings, they're asking hard questions, they're working together in groups, they're proposing new policies and defending their positions while gaining a better understanding of government today. So like, although we're bringing resources and food over, like how many and how much of the population is actually not getting any of those resources at all? I think they really surprise and impress themselves when they're here, and I can definitely say they impress us as well. Our educational programs are rigorous because Harry Truman knew what we all know. Walking the hallways of today's schools are the kids who will one day walk the halls of Congress. These programs matter. Your support matters. The students who come to the Truman Library are more likely to vote, get involved in community issues, reach out to their elected representatives, even run for office. Thank you for standing with us in this vital mission. Together we can contribute to a better tomorrow by helping the rising generation understand the American presidency, our dynamic democracy, and their power to make a difference.